Hey YouTube, it's Ariel here, selfpublishedwiz.com and in this video I want to show you, a lot of people have asked me about this tool that I've blogged about and I've started putting up shorts. I've started putting up shorts to show you how quickly the tool works. It's actually quite remarkable. But yeah, a lot of people have asked me to show more of an in-depth how it's used, what can you actually do with it because you're either going to read the long blog post that I've written or you're going to see a short and it's either sometimes it's too much information, sometimes it's not the right medium. So I really wanted to come and show you just some of the different things and before I was a bit concerned about the my information already being there so I think I've solved that. I've made a new folder and uh, you've yeah I'm just going to start from scratch and, and see what it looks like in my account <laughs> it should be all clear and i just want to show how how it can be used for one so if you are if you're into low content publishing if you are into just publishing in general you can use it for poetry for creative writing for um, non-fiction if you've got all your research and you want to write a book on what your subject on on the niche that you're in you can use it for query letters, you can use it to create contracts, you can use it for uh, marketing, so writing book descriptions in Amazon. You can really just use it to improve your text and help you as an editor. With that being said, you still do need to, if you look up in the, the top corner here, it has Grammarly integrated. So you do still, <clears throat> you do still need to um, edit, of course, you can't just press compose. There's a compose button down here, I'm going to move myself here. So you can't just press compose and expect it to write the entire thing for you. You do need to hold its hand. Let me move this over a bit because this is in the way. You do need to hold its hand a bit, but once you get the hang of it and you know where you want to go, you could do, there's nothing you can't do. There's nothing you can't do with it. So one of the things that I like to use with it is this uh, voice, it's a free voice. It's called voice in typing, voice in typing. And that's a Google Chrome extension. And that just allows you to, you put your cursor in the text box and it's just voice to text, basically. You can use voice to text to get your ideas down, but I like to use it with the tool with Jasper because it's just a lot quicker. There's there's not much typing you need to do to get what you need to get done. But what I wanted to show you is how the AI, how well it does with poetry and creative writing. And you can virtually, you can give it anything. And what you can do is give it a tone of voice. And the tone of voice can be a famous person. Or if you're writing a poem, it could be a famous poet. I like to use Maya Angelou. And you can tell it to write in the tone of that person and it generates 100% original creative writing text based on that information. So I've played around with it on the YouTube Shorts, I've played around with it and, um, and I wanted to go in a bit more depth with it and just show you how quick it actually does. It, it can generate poems. I've done a video that shows me generating five short poems in the space of, of less than a minute. I'm gonna say write a poem or write an a specific type of poem in the tone of and what you can do is you can have the output length as short medium or long for the sake of this poem flowing and just to show you how quick and how much text it generates in this in in the time period i'm just going to leave it on long but i've got to take away all of this text that it's trying to add and start again an engaging poem about time travel in the tone of Maya Angelou. <laughs> Time travel in the town of Maya Angelou is something that we all take for granted. We can go anywhere and any when in the blink of an eye. Oh, I like that, any when. Anywhere and anywhere in the blink of an eye. We can visit ancient Greece or see the dinosaurs walk by. Oh, it rhymes. 
We can even go back to when the United States was just starting out. There's no limit to where we can go or what we can see. When we travel through time, the only limit is our imagination. You've got to be careful of this text to this speech to text because as you can see it's trying to um trying to detect my speech. Oh, okay, I have put in the town, it said in the town, in the tone of Oprah Winfrey. What have you got, Jasper? Okay, so the output length was not set to long. I want it to be to be long, but that looks like a good poem, but let's just try that again. Let's do that again. Oops, it says in the town again, in the tone. All right. That's very short. You can press Command Z and it will redo it. Oh no, it will undo it. How do you get it to, I think it's Command Slash. Let's just try that again. I'm pressing Command Enter to run that command. Write me a good poem, don't show me up. I want, a, I want a masterpiece, computer. Love is the light that guides us through the dark. It's the hand that we cling to when we're feeling scared. Love is the force that keeps us going when we're down. It's the voice that whispers to us that we're not alone. Love is everything and nothing all at once. It's a mystery that we can never quite solve. And that's what makes it so special. And we wouldn't want it any other way. Chase! Yes, Jasper, that is a poem indeed. Let's, let's run that one again. Let's see what else you've got. Oprah. Oprah Tone. It keeps starting with love is the light that guides it. I don't, I don't know if I like you to keep doing the same thing. And it done it as a haiku. It's done it, <laughs> and it and it even signed it. it. Said it was Oprah. I don't want to get um. I don't want to get sued. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, and I like to use engaging. Let me see. Write a thoughtful. You can just play around with it. You can. There's no rules. That's what I love the most. There's no rules. Let me see. Who is somebody that's not quite a poet, but I don't know. Let's see what happens if I get her to write a poem like JK Rowling I just I don't know how she how she how Jasper would I don't even I don't know whoopsie look at me a thoughtful and it doesn't have to be a poem about love it's just the most typical thing let me copy that I'm gonna change it up a bit write a thoughtful poem about love in the tone of JK Rowling whoops I didn't press command okay. the command Love is the most powerful force. It can conquer all and bring hope. When times are rough, love is there to comfort and to care. I really, it really makes me happy when, when it rhymes. <laughs> all right, let me start again. Love is the most powerful force. It can conquer all and bring hope. When times are tough, love is there to comfort and to care. Its light shines through the dark and touches our hearts with, with, with its warmth. Love is a blessing from above. A priceless gift we should embrace. And you can just press Command J and it will continue. Let's see. Where does it go? Where does this poem, where does this engaging poem go? Where does this thoughtful love poem go? Jasper. Come on, Jasper. You've got to keep the flow going. You're moving a bit slow today. Maybe there's somebody actually in the company writing <laughs> writing the, the poem and really thinking about it they're taking quite long jk rowling is a good poet she's a good poet okay so we start again love is the most powerful force it can conquer all and bring hope when times are tough love is there to comfort and to care its light shines through the dark and touches our hearts with its warmth Love is a blessing from above, a priceless gift we should embrace and never take for granted. For love is the most powerful force in this world and nothing can compare. That is a good poem. That's a good poem. I just, I hats off. Let's see. Write a thoughtful poem about, hmm, what could we write a thoughtful poem about? Justice. 
a nice strong topic, JK. Let's see. And again, you can just play around. You can, that's quite, that's quite short. I think, let me try, is it command slash to, to redo it? No, what, what am I, I can't remember what it is. They do, where are those, those tips that remind me? There are some tips that tell you what the, try again. Oh, okay, not gonna work. All right, I want a long poem. I, I don't like these short poems. I like long, so I, I said thoughtful. Okay, write some more. Long, thoughtful poem. Okay, that, that looks like it's quite meaty. Oh, he's still going. Oh, wow, you, you really understood the assignment. Okay, a world of justice is what we need to make sure that everyone is treated fairly and with respect and given the same chance, no matter what their skin color may be and where they were born or where they, or what they believe. Ooh, justice is blind and will not discriminate. It's up to us to make sure that it prevails. For only then can we hope to achieve a world that is peaceful and free. A world of justice is what we need to make sure that everyone is treated. Oh, it's repeating itself. Okay. I thought it was writing some, wait, it, oh, oh, slow down. No, it is repeating itself. We all have a role to play in creating a just society, whether we are all our lot. Okay. Yeah. You get the point. Let's try and give it something else. Another keyword. Let's see. Right. A nostalgic nostalgic poem about time <laughs> in the tone of jk i like the out the outputs that jk rowling is is coming with so let's do another one i'm gonna try somebody else that, that just wouldn't write poetry at all that isn't even a writer i'd like to see i'd like to see gary vaynerchuk's poetry skills so what it does when it says tone it's analyzed a good chunk of ebooks and the internet and it has quite a lot of information on language patterns and that's how it's able to produce such human written content and so yeah so when it says tone it just gathers the the, the tone of the person and writes in that way the way that it expects them to write or say things and the words that it will use so this one Let's see, time is a precious commodity. Once it's gone, it can never be replaced. It slips away like water through our fingers, but we never realize its importance until it's too late. These are rhymes. Replace them. We all wish we could go back in time to relive those moments that we cherish the most, but we can't turn back the hands of time. And all we can do is learn from our mistakes. Cool. I like it. Let's see what else we got. A, hmm, right, a, uh, I don't even know what keyword, I just can't think of anything. Gripping, <laughs> that's a good word. A gripping poem about, about, what is there? Let's just do something in line about success in the tone of Gary Vaynerchuk. Jasper, don't let me down. I, I want something, I want something gripping. Gripping. I wake up, uh, <laughs> let's get some more first. I wanna read this. <laughs> oh my goodness. And it repeats itself. Is it a chorus or is it a poem? It does that sometimes, it repeats itself though. So. This looks like a, a hook for a song. I wake up early before the sun. I've got so much to do and I can't be late. It, it, it could have said something that rhymed with sun like done, but all right. I'm on a mission, I'm on a quest. I'm going to be successful no matter what. I work hard every day, I never give up. I'm going to make it, I'm going to be a star. There's nothing that can stop me now. I'm on my way to the top and I'm never looking. This is, that one's really bad. That's really bad. Gary is not, he's not a poet. He's just not a poet. We're just gonna have to accept that one. I could sit here all day. I could sit here all day and, and play around with this. In fact, I do. I sit here and I play around with Jasper because there's so many things that 
he can do. In this video, I just wanted to show the poetry aspects of things because it's, it's quite fun. I enjoy poetry, I enjoy songs, and it seems like Jasper's getting better because initially I'd done a post, I wrote a, a blog post about the poetry side of things, and I said, it's no Shakespeare bot, it's not gonna write outstanding poems, but it can do something decent, but it's changed since then. It's gotten better. I'm not sure what language models or what training and machine learning that it's been going through, but it's gotten a lot better with its poetry and its creative writing in general. So while I was like telling people about this tool as a good tool to help you um, finish your nonfiction book, it also, as I showed with my, I done a video on zombie introductions or zombie book ideas, and those were all entirely formed from Jasper. So the creative writing aspect of things is getting, is getting a lot better. It's definitely something to play around with. It's not gonna be for everybody, but if you do have an idea, this is what I say, if you have writer's block or you have an idea and you want to finally turn that into a book or you've just got loads of creative ideas and you're trying to figure out a way that you can put them together and actually have an end product, then this is the perfect tool to help you do it because it just makes it, it is so seamless. It just makes it so easy to do. And, and it's really fun though. You can just cut down the time it will take you. If you've got your characters and you want to build them out a bit more, you can do that. You can use it to help you. But yeah, that's it. If you do want to try the software out, you get 10,000 words completely free. You don't have to put in any um, credit card or anything like that. You just click the link and sign up. You get 10,000 words free, so you can, that's more than enough credits to play around with it. And if you like it, you sign up for the monthly subscription, get your book done, cancel it, or keep going, keep writing more books, keep writing more poems, and yeah, and enjoy. But that's it guys, if you enjoy this video, if you wanna see more like this where I go through the tool and I test it out for different things, as I said it does, it can do book descriptions, it, it, there's nothing it can't do in the world of writing so if you have an idea just drop it in the comments and i might get to it and show you how i would use the tool to do that but that's it guys hope you enjoyed the video peace